So if you want to be rich and maintain your wealth, it's important to be financially literate, in words as well as numbers. Search, offer, reject, negotiate, and accept are all parts of the process of almost everything in life. But what many people who have never formed a corporation don't know is that a corporation is not really a thing. A corporation is merely a file folder with some legal documents in it, sitting in some attorney's office and registered with a state government agency. It's not a big building or a factory or a group of people. A corporation is merely a legal document that creates a legal body without a soul. The poor and middle class work for money. Two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. In accounting, Rich Dad would say, it's not the numbers, but what the numbers are telling you. It's just like words. It's not the words, but the story the words are telling you. It is trained well, it can create enormous wealth seemingly instantaneously. An untrained mind can also create extreme poverty that can crush a family for generations. The KISS principle keep it simple, stupid, or keep it super simple. They think that more money will solve the problem and don't realize that it's their lack of financial education that is the problem. For example, when my wife Kim and I had extra money coming from our apartment houses, she went out and bought her Mercedes. It didn't take any extra work or risk on her part because the apartment house bought the car. The single most powerful asset we all have is our mind. If it is trained well, it can create enormous wealth. Leadership is what you need to learn next, he said. If you're not a good leader, you'll get shot in the back, just like they do in business. All of us have the power of choice. I choose to be rich and I make that choice every day. The reality is that the rich are not taxed. It's the middle class, especially the educated upper income middle class, who pays for the poor. Focus on the most important law of money, give, and you shall receive. Instead, he believed in, receive, and then you give. The illiterate of the 21st century will not be those who cannot read and write, but those who cannot learn, unlearn, and relearn. Losers avoid failing. And failure turns losers into winners. Learning how to tell a powerful story is learning how to show up as the winner you are. Have never met anyone who really likes losing money. And in all my years, I have never met a rich person who has never lost money. Learn to use your emotions to think, not think with your emotions. The size of your success is measured by the strength of your desire, the size of your dream, and how you handle disappointment along the way. For there to be profit in a deal, there must be two elements, a bargain and change. The fear of losing money is real. Everyone has. The Worldly Philosophers by Robert Heilbronner For people who want to operate on the B&I side, his book is a must-read, for it traces the greatest economists of all time, starting with Adam Smith who wrote The Wealth of Nations. Job is an acronym for Just Over Broke. Is it an investment property? Is it rented? What is the current rent? What is the vacancy rate? What are the average rents in that area? What are the maintenance costs? Is there deferred maintenance? Will the owner finance? 
What types of financing terms are available?